Welcome. Our topic for today's lesson is Approximation. Lesson duration remains 5 minutes. Let's check out the lesson objectives. By the end of this lesson, you should be able to learn the following. 1. How to approximate values to the nearest given unit. 2. How to approximate numbers to the given significant figures. 3. How to approximate numbers to the given decimal places. Please pay attention as we go through the lesson together. Let's now see what approximation is. Introduction to Approximation Approximation is the process of finding a number, acceptably close to an exact value. That number is called an approximate value. It has not always been possible, to give the exact value of some quantities. Therefore, we find it more convenient, to give approximate values. A number can be approximated, by rounding it up or down, to the required approximate value. The diagram on the board, shows how to round numbers, up or down, using the number line. Note that, the digits, 1, 2, 3, and 4, are rounded down to 0, while the digits, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9, are rounded up to 1. Approximation can be done in three ways. They include 1. Rounding off numbers to the nearest given unit. 2. Rounding off numbers to the given significant figures. 3. Rounding off numbers to the given decimal places. Next, let's see how to round off values to the nearest given unit. Rounding off numbers to the nearest given unit. Rounding off of numbers to the nearest unit, involves the following steps. Step 1. Identify the place value of the target digit to be approximated. Step 2. Round up to 1, if the digits after the target is 5 and above. Round down to 0, if the digits after the target is 4 and below. Step 3. The numbers before the digits are kept the same, in the now rounded version. Let's see an example. Question, approximate 21,567.4 to the nearest thousand. Solution, 21,567.4 equals, step 1. Identify the place value of the digit to be approximated. We are asked to approximate to the nearest thousand, which is 21,000. Step 2. Round up to 1 if the digits after the target is 5 and above. Round down to 0 if the digits after the target is 4 and below. Note that the number after the target is 5, so round up to 1, and add to the target to make it 2. Step 3. The numbers before the digits are kept the same, in the now rounded version. 2 remains 2, in the now rounded version. Therefore, 21,567.4 is rounded off to, 22,000. That's brilliant. Now, let's look at, Rounding off numbers to the given significant figures. Rounding off numbers to the given significant figures. Rounding off numbers to significant figures, involves the following steps. 1. The first non-zero digit from the left, to the right, begins the significant figure. 2. Ignore if the digit next to the significant figure, is below 5. That is, 0, 1, 2, 3, and 4. 3. Round up to 1, if the digit next to the significant figure is 5 and above, up to 9. Let's see an example. Question. 
round off 30.465 to a 3 significant figure. Solution Since we are rounding off to a 3 significant figure, we shall express the fourth figure of 30.465, which is 6. 6 is rounded up to 1, on the number line. 1 therefore is added to the target, which is 4 to make it 5, which gives us 30.5. Therefore 30.465 is equals to 30.5 in 3 significant figures. That is wonderful. Next, let's see, rounding off numbers to a given decimal place. Rounding off numbers to the given decimal places. Rounding off numbers according to the given decimal places, involves the following steps. Step 1. Start counting the digits from the decimal point towards the right, up to the place value given. Step 2. Consider the digit after the target, to either round up or down. In decimal, we also count the zeros after the decimal point. We use decimal place, as short form of decimal place. Let's see an example. Question 1. Correct 3.26075, to 3 decimal places, solution. Step 1. Start counting the digits from the decimal point, towards the right, depending on the number of place value given. In this case, we were given 3 decimal places. 3.26075 Counting from the decimal point, to the right, to 3 decimal places. 3.260 Step 2 Consider the digit after the target to either round up or down. Remember that, we are rounding off from the fourth decimal place, which is 7. 7 is rounded up to 1, on the number line. 1 is added to target to make it 1, to give us 3.261. Therefore, 3.26075 equals 3.261. In 3 decimal places, that's awesome. Next, let's see word problems involving approximation. Word problems involving approximation. Let's see an example. Question. A school field is 24.85 meters by 234.15 meters. Round off the area of the field to the nearest 10 meters. Solution. Area of the field is, 24.85 meters, times, 234.15 meters. This equals, 5,818.6275. To the nearest tens equals, 581. The number after the target is 8. 8 is rounded up to 1, on the number line. 1 is added to the target which is 1, to give us 5,820. Therefore 5,818.6275 meters equals 5,820 meters to the nearest 10 meters. That's awesome. Pause the video, copy the following assignment, and write the answers in your notebook. In summary, we have been able to learn the following in this lesson. How to approximate values to the nearest given unit. How to approximate numbers to the given significant figures. How to approximate numbers to the given decimal places. I believe you enjoyed the lesson, see you in our next class. Thanks. And goodbye.